Good morning year one and welcome to today's home learning. So we're going to start off today by doing the date. So if yesterday was Tuesday, what's today's date? Tuesday, what comes after Tuesday? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, fantastic. So let's go through and see if we can find Wednesday. Tuesday, Monday, Saturday, Thursday, Sunday, Wednesday. Fantastic, there we are, Wednesday. Let's pop Wednesday up. Now, if yesterday was the 23rd, let's get this, 23rd, what's the day? What comes after 23? 23, 24, fantastic. Today is the 24th. So if we look at today's day, today is Wednesday, the 24th of February, fantastic. And today's star name is this person. Keep up the fantastic work at home. Now, like Monday, we are not going to do a proper phonics lesson today. We are going to again look at handwriting, but before we do that, we are going to run through our uh, flashcards. So, let's have a go. We've got air, o, or, Fantastic work, Year One. Now we're going to go on to our handwriting. Okay, the three letters that we are looking at today are G, Q, and S. Okay. Now, can you remember our rhymes for any of these? Our G is. Um, I'll show you on here. We go up around the girl's face, down her hair, and give her a curl. Okay. So let's try that together. So. Up, around the girl's face, down her hair, and give her a curl. Okay, let's try it again. So, up, around the girl's face, down her hair, and give her a curl. Fantastic. Now, when you do go, what you've got to remember, like our A, we need to make sure we close the gate at the top. And we also need to make sure that we don't go all the way down. We don't want to do it like this, where we go all the way down here. And we also don't want this. If you notice what I've done here, is I haven't drawn on the line. There's this gap here, and this is down here. Make sure you start with your pencil on the line. So this black line here is where you have to start. And also, please make sure that you're not dipping too far, but also that you're are dipping at all because if you were to do a very small dip like this I might just think it's a qua. so when you do your thing make sure you're following the actual tracing so up around the girl's face down her hair and give her a curl and stop back on the line well done so what I'd like you to do is practice your gut and then write go get and gag and then stop what you're doing and um, then Unpause me and then come back, okay? So go do go now. So our next one now is qua. Can you remember the rhyme for qua? It's quite a tricky one to remember. And the way I remember it is if there is a queen on the inside. So we go up, around the queen's head, past her earrings, down her hair and give her a flick. Okay, so we'll try that uh, together. So up. Around her head, up past her earrings, 
down her hair and flick. So that's how what our cuff looks like. Let's try that again. Up, around her head, up past her ears, down her hair and flick. Now, what you'll notice I've done here is I've flicked quite high and it's gone really far up. We don't want it to look like that. We just want it to be just above the line. And if you notice here, my coiffure has just gone below this dotted line here. Make sure when you're doing yours, you do not go further down than this dotted line. And we also, we don't want you to go higher than the dotted line. So make sure you're staying somewhere in the middle. So up. Round the Queen's head, up past her here ears, down and give her a flick. Fantastic. So what I would like you to do is have a go at practicing your quack and then practice quack and quick and then come back and we'll do sets together. Did you have a go at doing that? Okay, can you remember the rhyme for s? It's really easy. It's we go up and then around the snake. And a flick at the end, okay? So up and sliver around the snake. Up and sliver around the snake. Fantastic. Now, when you're doing this, make sure first of all that you're facing the right way because I do get a couple of people that go like this. That's not right. So make sure it's ears facing the right way. And also make sure that you're doing the flick off the end because if you just stop here, when you go into year two and you start to join, there won't be anything to do it to join onto. So you've got to remember to do the flick off. Now, something that is happening when some of you are doing your handwriting is you are taking your pen off. Don't take your pen or pencil off that um, letter until you have finished. So I don't want to see anybody doing their s like this and then adding on the e's and that. That's not how it's done. It needs to be a quick, smooth motion. So up and sliver around the snake. Now, I would like you to do your s and your sit, sat and sat. Once you've done that, I want you to have a go at practicing all your letters again, either in your book or just scrap paper. And that is your handwriting lesson done for today, year one. Fantastic. So I'll see you for more Homelining soon. Bye.